Welcome to Marine Tech Hub. Today I'll be explaining you about the direction control valve. This is used in the hydraulic system or in the pneumatic system. So the first picture shows you three uh, box here. That means three position wall. This is a three position wall. That means at first this one is the first position. This is the second position. This is the third position. So now inside there is nothing shown here the next diagram we have the arrows shown arrows shows the flow flow direction it shows so if you see the first block you have a direction wall one going up direction going up others going down that means the fluid will go like this that means it is going to a here you can see here this one it will go through a and uh, B it will be pushing the piston and the B the oil will return back. So suppose if it is in the center position what happens is the hydraulic oil or pneumatic system the air will fluid will flow here and back to the tank. So nothing will happen to the movement of the piston. The third position is this position. The arrow you can see it is come like this that means the fluid which is flowing from here instead of going to A it will go to B B here that means it will go to B here you can see here it will go to B push the piston inside and the oil which is there, the other side A it will go back so this is the diagram for three position three position is this is one position second position third position and four way four way means p is one pressure side p is a drain side then a and b is another uh, way so four way that is a is one way here b is the second one p and t is the third and fourth so if you see this diagram here this is one more diagram you can see here here the configuration is more or less the same but center position you can see a different indication over here more or less what is happening is the uh, the flow will go like this and come back and you can see in this picture there is a spring here you can operate this by spring so different ways to operate is mechanical handle you can have or electronic that is electrical solenoid you can see this is the solenoid here or you can have a hydraulic pilot pressure also to push it or spring this is a spring you can see so in this block you can see you can either use spring or solenoid and uh, the schematic diagram is here here they are showing the pump taking oil from the tray here P pushing the flow then P is the return so you can see the position showing here action A is position 1 no action position extended position 3 this is all I have explained you uh, this is they are showing at different position what will happen that is when it is in this position what will happen is flow of oil will come from here through this this uh, this block will be shifted here so this flow will be going to A here and push the piston here and B the oil will come back through this arrow into the tank and similarly when the block is in this position the oil will come here go through this arrow and go to B here push piston this side and oil which is in the other side A will come through this arrow and come back to the tank I hope you understand the drawing if you have any message regarding this let me know thank you